Africa, often called the cradle of humankind, is home to some of the oldest and most significant archaeological discoveries on Earth. But how far back does the human story truly go? And what do these ancient traces reveal about our origins? Our journey begins in East Africa's Great Rift Valley, a region stretching over 6,000 kilometers. It is here that some of the most remarkable evidence of early humans has been unearthed. In the 1970s, a groundbreaking discovery changed our understanding of human history. The famous paleoanthropologist Dr. Mary Leakey unearthed something extraordinary in Tanzania's Latoli region. Fossilized footprints preserved in volcanic ash over 3.6 million years old. These were the first clear signs that our ancestors walked upright long before the invention of tools or fire. These footprints, believed to belong to Australopithecus afarensis, revealed a critical piece of the puzzle. The anatomy of the foot and the distinct heel-to-toe stride pattern confirmed that walking on two legs was a key evolutionary step. But the story doesn't end there. In Ethiopia's Afar region, another iconic discovery took place. Meet Lucy, one of the most famous fossilized hominids ever found. Discovered in 1974 by Donald Johansson and his team, Lucy's 3.2 million year old skeleton was 40% complete. Her small frame and upright posture provided further evidence of bipedalism. Lucy's discovery sparked excitement and debate across the scientific community. Here was proof that our early ancestors lived in both trees and on the ground, adapting to a changing environment. As we journey further south to South Africa, the discoveries only get older. This region is a UNESCO World Heritage Site, famous for its wealth of fossils. In the Sturkfontein Caves, scientists have uncovered fossils dating back over 2.5 million years, belonging to species like Australopithecus africanus. These findings paint a picture of early hominids who faced challenges in a world teeming with predators. But what about even older evidence? For that, we must return to East Africa, to Kenya's Turkana Basin, where a significant discovery was made. Turkana Boy, a nearly complete skeleton of Homo erectus, was discovered in 1984 by Richard Leakey's team. Dating back 1.6 million years, this young boy's bones revealed not only a more advanced physique, but also signs of early social behavior. Standing nearly five feet tall, Turkana Boy was well adapted for endurance running and a life of mobility. His story gives us insight into the evolution of our species, hinting at the development of community and the use of simple tools. Speaking of tools, some of the oldest evidence of tool use comes from Ethiopia's Gona region. Here, archaeologists discovered stone tools dating back 2.6 million years. Known as the Oldowan tools, these simple but effective instruments marked the dawn of human innovation. With them, our ancestors could butcher meat, break bones for marrow, and shape their environment in new ways. As time marched on, so did our ancestors' adaptability. The control of fire, thought to have occurred around 1.5 million years ago, was a game changer. It provided warmth, protection from predators, and a place to gather. These early gatherings around fire laid the groundwork for social interaction and culture, shaping the very essence of what it means to be human. Today, Africa continues to be a land of discovery, revealing the deep and ancient roots of our species. Every fossil, every footprint, and every tool adds another piece to the intricate puzzle of human evolution. From humble beginnings to the complexity of modern humans, our journey through time is a testament to adaptation, survival, and innovation. The oldest evidence of people in Africa is not just a story of the past, it's the foundation of who we are today.